Okay, there we go. So, uh, if you just go ahead, first off, uh, go ahead and here and check what I'm running. Oh, wait a sec. Let's see. Yes, there you can see um, I am running on 5.0. So, that's kind of awesome. Okay, so let's just go ahead and tap on jailbreak in Red Snow. Uh, now you need to go ahead and go to DFU mode, um, and it's very simple. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go to DFU mode right now on my Leo device. So first of all, obviously we need to turn it off. Okay, you slide. Awesome. I'm recording with my iPhone 4 right now. I'm gonna get like, like a webcam soon, I think. Okay, so uh, to go into DFU mode, you just hold in the home button and the you know power on button for 10 seconds, and then you basically just go ahead and release the power on button after like seven seconds. There we go. After you've been doing this for a while, you, you can, you know, go ahead and do it, like, in your sleep. <laughs> I don't even count the time, but should be 10 seconds. Uh, but as you can see, it's currently identifying and now I'm releasing when I see that they are exploiting and everything. You can probably release it earlier, but, you know. That's how I do it. And there you can see I have an iPod Touch or I have an iPhone 4 you can see the Apple okay awesome so um, let's go ahead and enable battery percentage is install Cydia uploading RAM disk oh yes Oh yes, um, yeah, it's kind of nice. Uh, okay, so it's currently tethered. Uh, now you need to do anything. This is very important. You must you, you, now you must go back to just with tether right now. Uh, wait a sec. The jailbreak for this device is currently tethered. This means in order to make use of any jailbreak points, you must uh, use the just with tether right now. Blah blah. Reboot the device. Even if, and yeah, this is very important. Even if you just apply the jailbreak, you now uh, must not go back and just boot tethered. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back. Just boot tethered. Um, and now it's doing a lot of things. Um, yes! You can see that thing uh, doing a lot of things in the background here. So I suppose we are just gonna wait until this thing will be finished. And this is important stuff. It's now doing a lot of things. And hopefully Camtasia won't crash or anything like that. It did crash like the first time I did this. And that was like annoying. I'm sure if the webcam video is going to be any good. May have to, you know, just input the Canon 60D video instead or something like that. Uh, yeah. But it will do a lot of things over here. And I think you can make you know it faster if you disable this move applications. Mm. 
There we go. We have the Apple logo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have dual apples. And I, I'm probably gonna get a webcam so I don't have to record. So you know, I, I will have like no lag. Right now, it's using like a Wi-Fi, and that kind of sucks. Okay, now it shouldn't be able to boot up. Now we are gonna go ahead, I suppose, go into DFU mode again. As you know, okay, there we go. Okay, so as they said there, even though you still have jailbroken, uh, you should go ahead and go back and tap on just boot header right now. So we're just gonna turn it off again. Let's see, my my power button up there on the top is a little messed up. Uh, so go back 